Highlights was an event commissioned by the Cairo Business Association for Christmas for instead of putting up centres and fairy lights to illuminate buildings with projectors projecting art, imagery and animation. Previous to this project I've worked with quite a range of projectors from household office projectors to serious rentals from the 5 to 10k range and I was assuming that I would need some incredibly bright, incredibly expensive rentals. When I looked at Epson and I had the three LCD technology explained to me, I didn't fully understand the difference between LCD and DLP. However, when I turned this projector on, I was absolutely blown away by the brightness of not just the whites, but the colours. In places of high ambient light, with just one projector, the lens enabled me to hit full buildings and create quite an impact with the people that were viewing it. Installing the projectors was an interesting one for this project because due to the time of night there wasn't too many people interested in letting us into their apartments between 9 and 11 at night. So we had to operate mainly from street level. What I really liked about the G-Series was that it was very light. So we were able to get into some really cool spots and I guess unorthodox spots. So we used the tops of telephone boxes and even in some case a mailbox. And if we didn't have those, a trestle table and what was cool is it didn't matter where it was rigged from, we were still able to get a very large, bright, awesome picture on what I would say is some interesting services. Since this project and working with Epson projectors, it's really turned, in some cases, what I thought I knew about brightness and image quality literally on its head. For its class, it really performs close to much more expensive maybe even better than some 10K projectors I've actually worked with, and definitely other 5K projectors. It is so bright, and the images look so good on almost any surface, and I just don't think our event would have been the same without them.